Hello and welcome back to my channel all you beautiful siren beauties if you are new to the channel thank you for watching hope you like what you see and if you are a returning subscriber thank you for returning to the fun and these are my nails I did a video on these about a week ago and as you can see they are already growing out but if you want to see the tutorial of this i will leave it in the description bar below as well as some card around up here so in today's video it is going to be a haul of some goodies that i have gotten you all seem to enjoy hauls and i enjoy sharing the little goodies that i get so we're going to get right into it starting out with some items that i got from kiara sky I got two polishes. This one is the Kiara Sky Jelly Tints, and I believe this is a new line that they just came out with. And this color intrigued me. I'm not gonna do swatches, because like I said, this is gonna be really quick. Um, this is like an amber color that it really intrigues me because I have seen in the past when they do tortoise nails that they kind of put this on top and I wanted to try that design so I got this. Next up from one of my past videos if you remember I bought a bunch of these Kiara Sky glitter polishes and I did want to add to the collection so I got this one right here it is called Deep Sea. And this is it. Oh, it's so blue and pretty. Oh, 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 oh. This is gonna be great for holiday nails. Um, I can see a, some even Christmas nails. I can see me doing design for Christmas with these. This is actually really cute. So those are the two polishes that I got. Next up we have, in the last video you saw that I did my nails. And I was saying that I liked a sharper stiletto. So when I was on Kiara Sky, I saw these. And these are the Kiara Sky Jelly Tips. They've been out for quite some time. And these are the short stiletto. And they come in 029. And I'm just gonna pull out a number two. And we're gonna compare this to the a prey. So that is the number two right there. Let me get the a prey number two. Boo, 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 boo. Hope everybody's having a great weekend. I'm filming this on a Sunday. I hope everybody, whenever you're watching this, you're having a great day or night. So here. Let me see if you can see this. So this is the Apre. Uh, 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 I'm trying to see if I can see something with a uh, different background. Okay, so you kind of see it a little bit better here. So this is the Apre number two. And then this is the Kiara Sky number two. Well, Kiara Sky shape. And you can already tell that this one is a lot pointier and narrower than the a prey. Maybe if I just put it over here. Yep, there we go. Girl, you're doing too much right now to try and prove a point. Okay. So let's zoom you in. So here you can see this. This one's shorter and a little bit fatter. And this one, even though they're both short, this one is longer and narrower. I personally prefer this one. You can see that I, well, these got dulled out a little bit because of typing and wear but this is what I would actually typically wear. I would also even just file it up a little bit more right at the very, very tip because I want a very sharp, sharp point. So that's how these look. Let me see if they're actually the same size. Hold on. I will say that these feel a little bit thinner than these, so... I'm a little worried about the durability, just a tad bit, but we'll test that out in the next video. These so far have lasted quite some time. I've even opened up some very challenging packages and they have not broken, they are stuck on. So that's how that looks. 
they're even just a tad bit longer because of that little point. Sorry, I'm out of frame. So, oof, God, I love it. And the last thing I got from Kiara Sky were also the Kiara Sky Jelly Tips, these short squares. So I now own all of the Kiara Sky Jelly Tips in all the sizes that they have. I'm actually thinking about selling press-on nails. So I did wanna make sure that I had all of the sizes and shapes and everything to kind of start off this business process, but it's still a work in progress. So that is all from Kiara Sky. These are also really dope, dope too. I can't wait to play in them. Next up, I'm going to share some goodies that I bought from Crystal Parade. Now this is a new company that I've tried. In the past when I had the Preciosa haul, that was from Blue Street Crystals, I believe. So this one is from Crystal Parade. This is a company that uh, YouTubers use a lot, especially ones that I follow. So we decided to just check them out. Um, depending upon when this video comes out, I do plan on doing a design based around some of these mixes. I didn't get single colors. These are more so mixes. So depending upon what happens, we'll see when this video comes up. So this first one here, let me zoom you in, is called Purple Rain. And this has a chunk full, this is 100 pieces, and these are just different types of purples and pointy backs. So let me open this up for you. I have not done any of it. I know I have to repackage a lot of these too. Oof. Oof, get them all out, come on, come on. Oh no, y'all stuck. Well, we'll get those a little bit later. But here's how this mix looks. And it's just a lot of really pretty pointy backs and small stones. These are a lot smaller than I thought they would be, but it's a fun mix to have. So that is called Purple Rain. Next up, we have Egyptian Sands. And all of these are just mixes. These have a lot of these big clusters. Let me pour it out for you. These big, beautiful pointy backs. And it's just golds and silvers and blues. They shake up and want to reveal themselves, so that's how that looks. And the mixes, I believe, they come whatever they have in stock and whatever color scheme that is, that's how they do it, I believe. So they have a lot of pointy bags and some of these little ones, pretty. Next up, we have this Christmas mix and these are very tiny. I think these are no bigger than, I wanna say about an SS6 in this mix. That's very pretty. I'm gonna just run through these really quick. Next one is burlesque. And you have these very pretty blues and some purple, of course, some more pointy backs. And what are these? Ooh, ooh, you don't wanna flip. There you go, we have a couple of, I believe these are baguettes in there. This is a really pretty mix. And this is why I said, depending upon, cause I'm also waiting on a couple more packages, Depending upon when everything comes in, I actually want to do a set with these. Next up, we have, what is this one called? This one is called Wonderland, and this is another mix. These are all mixes with very tiny stones. Really pretty. Oh, love, 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 love. Next up we have, what is this called? Autumn Days. This was a very unique mix, hence why I got it. Purples and the blues and the greens and the gold. Very pretty. 
here we have elegant opals and this was a mix of 200 so you have the different opalescent colors from Preciosa next up is autumn days no this is just called autumn mix and this was a 200 piece set most of them are 100 but I will tell you with these are 200 so this is a 200 piece one and you have all your typical autumn colors this one is called Cosmopolitan. And this was very cute because I also have that Maniology cocktail plate. So I thought this would be very cute to do a set of nails with. And all of these mixes, I would say, is a really good starting point for, you know, if you want to build up your collection, you want to see what's out there. If you don't know how to mix colors for sets, these little ones are actually very cute and they range from anywhere of $3 to about five per, I wanna say. You have to double check me and of course that is in US. It is always different when it comes to pounds, et cetera, et cetera. This next one, this final mix is called Pink Champagne and this one includes some pear-shaped stones very cute lovely lovely very girly and then last but not least for this they did give me a little mix bag and as a little thank you so these are just a lots of little miscellaneous stones i'm not sure what this is supposed to be don't know what i'm supposed to do with it but it's very nice that they even added on extra pieces so we always love a little freebie Last but not least, I have a couple of goodies from my new favorite nail site period, I think, overall, Maniology. But before that, I just wanted to let you know that I did do a short using the Autumn Day set. So that is the short where I say if I did the Vivian's nails, I did use this set as inspiration and it I feel it came out very pretty. So don't forget to check that out. Okay, what did we get from Maniology? First and foremost, we have this. I did say in the last video when I did the haul for them that I did see a couple of pieces from their new Halloween collection. And this is just the main one that I wanted. It's another nail stamping plate book, but as you can see, it has all these really cute ghosts. And I will just be using this to put in all of my Halloween plates from that haul. So I definitely checked that haul out. It's a lot of inspiration going on, especially for Halloween season. Next up we have, where do I wanna go? Where do I wanna go? we have this now this is oops excuse moi, let me pull you out a little bit more there we go this is maniology's nail lacquers and these are the do, 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 stamping polishes but this is the natural set so let me see if i can pull this out and this is how it comes their packaging is very sturdy, very nicely done. And then you're just gonna take all of this off. Ooh. Oh, wow. And then you have all of these colors. So it comes in six, this particular set. And these are all just Nail stamping polishes. Oh, here we go with all of the polishes. So in no particular order, we have boba. And it is this really dark chalk, like kind of a muted purpley color. Then we have cocoa, which is your brown. Gorgeous. We have, I don't, do not get me to line on this one. Sequoia, Sequoia, I think that's how you say it. I could have that completely wrong. And this is really pretty. This is like I said, this is all their neutrals. So this is like a mauve lighter brown. 
Mm. Latte. Latte. We always need a latte. Very nice. So I got this set in particular because I have an idea in mind that I'm going to execute very soon. Next we have ballet flats. That's a cute fall pinkish color, pinkish nudie. And then last but not least, we have skin deep, which is your honestly kind of beigey color. So these are all, how many? 13 mils, 0.4 fluid ounces. So you get a nice little bunch. It lasts for two years very pretty next up we have the essentials primary set so this is another six piece um, nail stamping polishes and this is gonna have all of your basic colors like your black your white your red your blue um, gold and silver I believe are in here so let's check this. and here we are oh this is pretty so from the white we have BAM white that is just your straight up white. Then we have, <laughs> funny enough, straight up black. And there you go. Then we have So Metal. This is a pretty silver. And I can just already tell, even without like opening it up crazy, these are just, like you could just see that these are good quality. Look at that metallic. Oh yes, just got so excited. Then we have Heart of Gold, this pretty gold shade. Oof, it's more of a yellowy gold. Then we have Midnight Madness, which is your cobalt blue color. Always need one of these. And last but not least, Fireside. And this is like a true bright red color. Very good for basic, very good for Halloween. Oh. Yes, so I decided I'm gonna start um, collecting or expanding my collection of the Maniology Nail Lacquer Stamping Polishes. But so far, this, these two sets, I would say, if you're going to start off with nail stamping, get these two. So this is the Maniology, the Essentials, and then we have, let me see if I can put you in here. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Ooh, there we go. So I feel like these 12, if you're going to start, let's say you never did stamping, you go a maniology, you're like, I'm gonna get everything. I would get these two first. See how you like it, see what's going on with it, and then expand little from little from there. They have a lot of different ones. I think I've seen like different precious metals, different metallics, lots of shades for your basic colors and every range possible, like just as much as regular gel polishes. So there's a lot to choose from and it can be overwhelming. But like I said, I'm my channel. We're trying to keep things very simple as we can for the beginners. And this right here is that. Last but certainly not least, I saw this plate when I first did my first order and I didn't think that I would need it. And then I saw it again in the Maniology Facebook group. Somebody had did a set with it. And because of the release of the trailer for The Little Mermaid, which I am so excited for, I cannot wait at all. It is cruel and unusual punishment to make me wait because she is my favorite mermaid. We have this plate. I believe this was a collaboration plate. This is the Maniology TWI Star XL211 and it is the plate. If you are into mermaids, let me zoom you in. I'm zooming you all the way in on this. Look at it. Take this in. You have a full-blown mermaid here. You have all the ships. This is mermaid and this is like Little Mermaid inspired. Of course, for licensing purposes, they can't be like, yeah, this is a Little Mermaid. But come on. 
come on right here you got sebastian flounder and ariel like come on somebody in the group did a set with these in honor of Haley bailey being little mermaid and trying to combat all of the nonsense that is going on with it some of y'all just need to get over it and this is it this oh i'm so happy i got this played Oof. And that concludes our haul for today. We will have a lot more goodies coming out. We will have a lot more things going on. Also, I am thinking about selling press-ons. I think about doing a small collection for the Halloween season and holiday season. So let me know down in the comments below if you would actually be interested in buying these sets. I think my first collection that I want to do will all be 20 piece um, sets. So it'll be quite easy for you to find what you need and your sizing. And yeah, so let me know if you will be interested in that. And I will definitely film a video of me making a 20 piece set and how I would go about it. But until next time, bye.